Malaki Chief Minister and AMNO Vice President Dato Seri Muhammad Ali Rustam has been guilty of breaching party ethics and is barred from contesting in the AMNO elections next week. AMNO's disciplinary board found AMNO Youth Deputy Chief Kairi Jamaluddin guilty of breaching AMNO campaign rules. He is, however, let off with a warning and allowed to contest for the wing's chief post. Former Selangor Menteri Besar Dato Seri Dr. Mohamad Kiritoyo, who is charged with money politics, is cleared of any wrongdoing. Dr. Kir and Dato Mukris Tun Dr. Mahathir are the two other contenders for the AMNO Youth Chief's post. Disciplinary Board Chairman Tengku Tan Sri Ahmad Ritaudin Tengku Ahmad says, Ali is found guilty under Article 10.1 of the party's Code of Ethics. He says, Ali is presumed guilty for the actions of third parties. 10.1, di mana yang dijelaskan tadi, adalah something like a presumption under the legal system, law, what it is. Jadi, kesalahan dia tu boleh disebabkan ada ada sabit, ada link, iaitu pekerja dia ke apa saja yang buat salah, Maka dia sebagai prinsipal, dia enggakkan bersalah juga. Tetapi kesalahan dia tidaklah begitu seperti apa yang dilakukan oleh ejen dia itu. Tengku Ritaudin says Kairi was let off with a warning because the nature of offences committed by his agents were less serious compared to that committed by Muhammad Ali's agents. Three of Ali's agents who include his political secretary, Saadun Basirun, is found guilty of votes buying and have been suspended for three years. The two others are a committee member of Bukit Katil AMNO Division, Rosli Hassan, and its Putri Wing Deputy Head, Zalina Ismail. Ali is the Bukit Katil Division Chief, Topuyan, The Star Malaysia.